In a primetime news exclusive, the mother of Danielle Rowe has broken her silence. This comes just days after a person of interest was taken into custody in relation to the killing of the eight-year-old. Sudeen Mason says she believes her daughter's killer is known to the family. Details in this report. I know why hurt my baby. Question of the serve that she's just an innocent baby. She's just innocent. No child deserves a death like that. It's been over two months since the brutal murder of eight year old Daniel Rowe. But for the grief stricken mother, Sudine Mason, the deep sense of loss is too much to bear. Every night, my child gave a plate on my head. What you tried to play out? What happened to her because I was told that she was holding her throat when, when it was cut. So I think about it because she must feel free and just want to go home to her mother. So it's playing on my head every night, every night. People tell me to stop thinking about it, but I can't. I just think about the pain what she got through. Despite the brutal killing, a chance for some justice has emerged. A woman, deemed by the police as a person of interest, is now in custody. I feel it's a bit of relief, but not as much because I've been, I just want just to be served because I know there's other person must be involved in this. It's been over 48 hours since the police made that revelation, but no new information has been forthcoming about her connection to the incident. But what is clear is that the person who picked up Daniel on that fateful day called her by a name that very few people knew. When I address her by her middle name, I mean her father alone. I address her as that name, as April. Because she come and ask for April. Nobody is nor would address her by April. Miss Mason is leveling blame at the school for how they handled the situation. She explained there were only three individuals authorized to pick up the eight-year-old child. The teacher said that the person come and ask for April and they see that April and the person was talking. The teacher is going to say that she never see anything off with April but yet still call me because if this female have got through the main office and guidance counselor something is wrong. Even after she died I still don't get that explanation about this female coming at the school. Nobody tell me anything after hear from the investigating officers. So I held them um, accountable for that. Since the incident, Daniel's little brother, once a student at Brayton Primary School, has been moved. Because um, of what happened to his sister, I don't want it to happen to my son then. Because she was taken from the school, I don't know what can happen. And for their carelessness is why my child is, um, my child is dead. Because as I said, they don't, nobody don't call me. And if the abduction was not heart-wrenching enough, she also had to endure the drama that unfolded at the funeral. The day at the funeral, that's, that's, not, that's, that does, that's not the send-off I want to give her. So as I said, she's a very um, peaceful person. That's all I wanted, everything to just go as smooth and just bury her um, um, properly. A lot of person didn't even get to see her because she was buried so quick. So I guess they were the pastors, they were afraid about something's going to happen, so they just bury her quick. Due to the seeming uncertainty around the investigation, it could be some time before justice is served. But when that time comes, this is what Daniel's mother hopes for. The penalty for those persons that is responsible for my daughter's death. I don't want no 20 years, no 30 years, I just want straight death penalty. But whatever the outcome, all she can do now is continue to replay her daughter's last words in her mind. The morning when we went to school, she kissed me and she said, Mommy, may I go make me finish my project because she had a project for the Friday. And she said, Mommy, when I come home, may I go finish my project. And she kissed me and she went inside. Dwayne Anderson. TVJ News.